Chris from e-commerce style and in this video I'm going to guide you how we can dropship products from Timu for your Shopify store. Right before we're going to start there are a few important things to know. The first thing is that Timu doesn't allow dropshipping to happen. What it means is that they would probably get your account banned and the next thing is that even like some people I know that they couldn't verify the order that is not dropshipping. Another thing is their own packaging that looks like this that could be a problem too. So what we have to do is we have to find like a way around it, how we can dropship the product. So here it is. So first let me talk about the whole process and then I'm going to show you how we are going to do it together, step by step. So the first thing is that we have to find a product on Timu. What is really great about Timu, a product research, is that you're going to have the opening sale here, new arrivals or even bestsellers. For, so the researching for the product is much better in my opinion comparing if you're gonna like research it on aliexpress so that's a huge advantage comparing to aliexpress the image quality is on another level like if you just check the the image quality on timu comparing to aliexpress this is just much better so first we're gonna find a product then we're gonna install these two ex extensions image downloader for downloading the images and then aliexpress search by image to find that specific product that we have on uh, Timu, we're gonna find it on AliExpress from the supplier. And there are like also some important things there too. And then we're gonna use a tool called Deezers in my opinion, that's like the greatest tool, but um, I'm not affiliated with them or anything. So no affiliation there. And what are we gonna do? We're gonna use Deezers to import the product from AliExpress to our Shopify store. Now, important thing to know is that when you're going to search for a product on Timu and you then search it, let's say for AliExpress and you find there are like so many suppliers already making the product, probably it's going to be burned out already. So uh, just when you don't have a lot of suppliers that are providing the product and you know, it's like new arrival on Timu and I'm like, God damn, you know, I could probably sell this. <laughs> so uh, that's like another thing. And also what I like to do is that I try to uh, research the image on Google about how many competitors there are on Shopify. And then I try to find their ads on Facebook. So that's another thing that you can do is that just research it by image and check out how many sellers there are for the specific product. But again, the researching on Timu is just amazing. Now, this is the whole process. I hope it's not much because it's super simple. So what we're gonna do first, Let's say that we want to find our best sellers here and we're going to find some product that we're going to sell further. Like for example, I wouldn't choose this one here. And what you're looking at, I'm looking for like a wow effect, like something that people are going to be like, God damn, I want this. So if we can find something like that, it could be really good. So let's see something right here here yeah, for example like these ones here or like for summer this is also good okay we're gonna verify i did it i did it right <laughs> so here we got it right and it looks really good we got also some video and i don't like the chinese thing here so i'm not going to use it Okay, or like this one here, right? So you see, this is for the garlic press. And let's say that we want to sell it. So we have also uh, like everything here. So you're gonna have the image downloader here, but what you want to do is that when you're gonna find a product, you wanna right click on it and search goods on AliExpress by this image. We use this extension called AliExpress search by image. And then you're gonna have the image downloader. So first, I'm going to have the AliExpress here. Let me show you. Image downloader. And like you see right here, that these are the images that we have that we're gonna download soon enough. So I'm going to right click, search goods on AliExpress. And you see right here. 
So I'm going to open this tool, sort by orders. And look at this. So we have it right here and this is the black color. And even the, the black color here looks great. Now I'm just going to compare it. Let's say we would have only the black one. Yep. And this could be it. And you can find plenty of products like these. Now when you're going to have the product, what we're going to do then is that we're going to check the shipping here and everything. And I'm just going to add to Deezers right here. Deezers is another app. Like if you don't have yet your own Shopify store, you're going to find a link down below in the description. Bring your ideas to life for one euro a month or one dollar a month. So I'm going to go to Shopify and you want to download an app called Deezers. Shopify apps. Deezers. Okay, my store. And here I'm going to show you this is like a demo store that I created. I'm going to have like apps. Deezers. And here we got it. So I'm going to have this product. I don't know where was the product. Yep, here it is. So I'm going to add to Deezers. It will download again the extension for Deezers 2. And now AliExpress product import success. So what we're going to do now. So I'm going to come here. And I'm going to have it in import list on Deezers. And here it is. So I'm going to edit the product. And first you have to edit the title. So for the title, what I like to do is that I try to use chat open AI. And here I'm going to send a message. So I'll write me a great short product title from this text. Look at this. Here we got it. So we have a great product title right here. Then we can change image if we want to, but we're going to do it directly in Shopify. Then again, the variants here. So we have the one product, which is like black here, uh, 2.98. So you see the cost, price value, compare, stock on Shopify. So we're going to have, let's say, 9.99. Then we're going to have description here and we're going to see the images right here that we would have. My also recommendation is that if you want to use the images or whatever from Timu or from like AliExpress, you want to get some SEO image optimizer for optimizing the images. So your, the page speed of your site would be much faster. So that's something you can do. Now, when I come here and I have the specifications, And I go, everybody yeah, wants to do it. So I'm just going to come here and again, write me a product description about with these specifications. And it's going to again, use these specifications about this product that I mentioned and then I can just can copy it and add it and just edit the text on my whole site. Let's say that you're going to have a one landing page for this specific product. You can do it like this. Now when you're going to have it and I'm just going to copy it. I would paste it. And this is like the overview. And I would possibly edit for overview, but I would just like delete this if you want to. This is just an example. Then I'm going to go for images. So here what you can do is remove the images here. Let's say this one, this one. Okay. 
let's say these images would suck because like even these images are looking great so shipping info and let's say that you want to target the united states and you see right here that china is super economic global is pretty long at express standard shipping uh, 14 to 20 days now I'll just click save here okay and now when we have it i'm just going to push to shopify push to shopify now we just await until it's going to be uh, imported and now what i will do i will open in shopify store and i'm going to preview the product and look at this so here we have it and now what i can do i can come here and let's say we want to use a picture from timu and we want to use this black one so we're going to go to image downloader and you have all the images here and we want to use this one here so i'm just going to download it and we have it right here and now what i would do i'm just going to add media and here we got it so i'm just going to click here we got it okay 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 preview and you see right here mamma mia so you see the two products and that's pretty much it about it how we can use it of course like my recommendation is trying to find products which got like are solving some kind of issue that's what i like to focus i don't like to mm, solve like a beauty stuff beauty product and even like a clothing because of returns what i like to do is just like resell stuff or dropship products which provide value to people that I like that I would like to use it for myself because then I can trust the product and also that for the look it's just going to catch the eye because it's all about the attention right you want to get attention from people and if you're gonna have like product let's say categories here and when we go home and kitchen home storage organization here okay or even cleaning supplies for summer you can start dropping some air stuff and now when i come here you can find plenty of great things here now also a, another really important thing is that you want to import the reviews from shopify with let's say looks or with Ali, from aliexpress to your shopify store with looks that is going to allow you again to or uh, like have those reviews from other people so for example this one but even glass things i wouldn't go for it so here you're gonna find just plenty of products just the images are looking really good so we can use the images from timu to aliexpress now let's summarize this whole video what we did so the first thing that we did we were Finding the product on Timu. When you're going to find the product, you don't want to use Timu because they are banning the dropshipping and those people who are trying to dropship. Then you want to find those products with those two extensions AliExpress search by image and image download for downloading images. With AliExpress search by image, we're going to find it on AliExpress and then we're going to use the Deezer 2 to import the aliexpress products to our shopify store bam and then oh someone is going to order and let me show you how the order open orders right here and then what you want to do is just shipping method here yeah i got already so here you would just uh, complete the order awaiting payment And you have to just pay for it and then with the customer like information so we're going to get the money you're going to pay for it on aliexpress and you got it 
So thank you very much guys for watching. Hope I gave you a little bit of value on how we can do this. If, if you're interested, you're going to find a link down below in the description for my newsletter where I'm writing tips and strategies how we can make more money with dropshipping. And have a great day and goodbye.